everyone assalamu alaikum welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to make sri lankan thatty pan it's similar to rose pan but thicker than that softer than the rose pan so let's check out the ingredients first we need 500 grams flour half cup milk 1 cup warm water and coconut oil for brushing you can use sri lankan regular coconut oil 1 tablespoon yeast and 1 and 1/2 tablespoon sugar and salt as needed like 1 teaspoon salt let's see proof the yeast first the water is warm so i'll leave it for 10 minutes and then let's do the do the yeast is proofed well so it's time to knead the dough now i am adding the salt and the proofed yeast and let's combine slowly and then add the milk I'm adding the milk now. If you are kneading in a bowl, knead it to a smooth dough for about 10 to 12 minutes. So I'm going to knead this on high for 7 minutes. I'll show you when I do it. I knead this for about 7 minutes now. going to stop it and see yeah test turn to a very soft dough so let's put it in a greased bowl let's put some coconut oil to the bowl and grease it really well and let's leave the dough and apply some coconut oil So I'm going to keep it to double in size for about one and a half hours, and cover it and keep it in a warm place. I'll show you when it becomes double in size. This has come double in size now after one hour and thirty-five minutes. So you can see it. Punch it down. And let's put it into the board. I put it into the board. and i'm going to divide into three equal parts and better if you can weight in a scale so we can uh, make even size bread 
so I divided it into three equal parts so I'm going to do the second proofing I'll show you how I do it I'm you I'm going to use this loaf tin you can use the regular loaf tin too so I'm going to make it to the exactly size of this loaf tin and just spread it like this apply coconut oil on both sides and then leave it to proof I'm going to put it in oil paper like this and fold it like this and now I'm going to proof it I'm going to do another one and I'll show you when I do both I'm applying the second one if you put the oil paper in the middle like this it won't stick together so it's easy to take it out so that was the reason why I did like that the I left for the second proofing for 45 minutes so the bread has risen well I mean the patty pan so I'm going to bake it on 350 Fahrenheit for about 30 to 35 minutes I'll show you when I do it and I have put a paper the oil paper so it won't stick together you can see it so that way it's easy to remove and bake it again I baked for about 30 minutes I'm going to remove it and I'm going to put it in a baking tray to roast the both sides The one side has baked well, so other side I'm going to put in the, this tray and bake it again. The thirty pan has baked well, the other side too. So I'll show you the both sides. So it's still hot. The thirty pan is ready for serving now. We are going to eat it with some pole sambal and beef curry. You can serve it with pole sambal and any other curries with some gravy. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe and like my channel and share it with your friends. See you soon with another Sri Lankan recipe. Thanks for watching.